Dr. Jesse Sanders, owner and chief veterinarian of Aquatic Veterinary Services. Today, we will be talking about green peas and their effects on fish health. Before we get started, I would like to point out that I have a medical degree in veterinary medicine. I am a certified aquatic veterinarian, licensed in both California and Nevada, and I have a nice big stack of reference books here, which I use to uh, verify all of my sources for these presentations. So a lot of people on the internet will say to feed green peas to a constipated fish. Now, most of the time, these are goldfish, but they can be other fish as well. Now, if you've checked out our other video on constipation, you know this really isn't the case for a lot of fish. So why do green peas work to make fish better? Well, first of all, they have a lot of vitamins. And if your food has been sitting around for a very long time, this can be very healthy for your fish to obviously have more vitamins in their diet. Now, they don't have any more fiber than the regular fish food. And since a lot of pet fish do not have a true stomach, they really don't get a lot of benefits from added fiber. It pretty much goes in one end and out the other. So having additional fiber in the diet really isn't a benefit for a lot of fish. Now, most importantly, green peas do not have a lot of protein. So protein is very important in fish diets. However, when it is processed, it leaves the fish as ammonia, which as you know, is not good for your water chemistry. Thankfully, your biologic filtration will convert your ammonia into nitrite and then nitrate. But if your water chemistry is already terrible, your fish are gonna be sick no matter what. So by decreasing the amount of protein coming into your system, you've automatically decreased the amount of ammonia, which is why this seems to work for constipated, but just otherwise sick fish. Now, a lot of the times, fish that are constipated will be floating at the surface upside down. A lot of the times these are goldfish and especially some fancy varieties of goldfish are more susceptible. Now goldfish are physostomous fish and this means that they have a duct between their esophagus and their swim bladder that allows them to inflate their swim bladder and maintain neutral buoyancy. But obviously if you've seen your goldfish feed at the surface, those little voracious appetites can accidentally suck in a lot of air during those feedings. So during that time, eating at the surface, suck in a little air, and then you have a floaty goldfish. So what the peas do is they are actually a sinking diet. So they cut off your fish's basically ability to inflate while eating and can help decrease the size of the swim bladder naturally. So that's kind of why those green peas work for your fish. They're full of vitamins, they are a sinking diet, and they decrease the ammonia in your tank, leading to better water quality. We hoped you learned something from our video today. If you have any additional questions or concerns about your pet fish health, please visit our website at cafishvet.com. We hope you join us at Aquatic Veterinary Services in treating your fish like family.